We're here with Sprint's head, Sprint's coach Adam Pennington. Uh, for uh, first, uh, I mean, one of your sprinters scenario, one uh, one track, uh, female track performer of the week. I mean, that's got to that's got to feel good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, big weekend for her. Big uh, jump and improvement right now. She's a uh, number two freshman in the U.S. Uh, number three, 400 meter, under 20 pound in the world. So yeah, she's uh, definitely sitting in a good position going forward from this point on. Yeah, did you uh, did you expect her to be uh, as good as she uh, has turned out to be so far, uh, or make a big of a, an as big of an impact as she has as a freshman? Um, yeah, no. Uh, yeah, for the fact that I, I knew what she was capable of doing, and I thought she would do it this year. Um, I didn't know it'd be this early in the season. Uh, I thought it would have been a little bit deeper into the season, but. Overall, yeah, I think I, I expected her to do some big things, just uh, recruiting her last year and bringing her in. We, we knew what she was capable of doing, and we knew we were getting a pretty good athlete. What type of uh, what type of things makes her uh, as good of a as good of a an athlete as she has, as she is? I think Megan Shaw has really pushed her to those limits. Um, I think anytime you have a girl who's continuing to be on uh, the top and, and run at a high level, who I think will turn right back around and break the school record herself. And I think it's gonna go back and forth between those two girls. I think that uh, that competition definitely fuels both of them to be better athletes. So I think those two have definitely sharpened each other. Yeah, and then uh, looking for like, yo, what do you what do you think uh, is her best uh, her best uh, event? Uh, Sonoria. Yeah. I mean, uh, she's number two in the world, 400. <laughs> um, uh, uh, she uh, she does pretty she does pretty well at other uh, other events, obviously as well. Uh, yeah, yeah. Four uh, four by. Uh, Four by four, I believe. Uh, she uh, she uh, she uh, she said she really likes that one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, no, she's. I mean, it mimics the four hundred, same race, you know. So uh, it, it's just a relay of four people, so same exact race. But yeah, that's her. That's her baby. Her baby's running the four. That's kind of what she did coming in, and she's transitioned to do some other things for us at the time. But uh, yeah, I would think her primary event is the four hundred four by four uh, relay for us, and everything else she does is obviously a bonus for us. But she's a pretty good athlete around. Yeah, and do you think uh, do you think uh, not only having her and Megan, but also uh, also uh, people like uh, Erico and Linnell, uh, do they uh, do they kind of fuel each other, uh, just uh, make each other better? Yeah, they do. You know, I mean, uh, I think she gets a lot of praise for being a, a great freshman, but uh, I think Vanessa Bald is the uh, same category, one of the best freshmen in the in the, in the country. Um, I think she does some things at a high level. Uh, I just think that the whole freshman group have really pushed each other pretty well all the way across the board. So I, I think that whole younger class is doing a good job of continuing to grow and get better with each other. And I think the older girls like Linnell and the Erica definitely have uh, led those girls in a good direction. Where uh, where would you rank this freshman class? Uh, you men you mentioned two, but also uh, you want, uh, they aren't sprinters, but people like Rand Randy Kelly have also uh, – also uh, done really well. Um, what would you rank this freshman class? Uh, definitely a deep freshman class. Uh, we've had some good freshman classes in the past, um, some, some overall good performances from, from freshmen. But this year, uh, I think this group of freshmen is a little bit different in the aspect that they're all willing to put in the work. It's been a very hard work for the freshman group, and we don't really have anybody that's just riding that wave. Like everybody's really working hard and grinding hard at this moment. Okay, thank you, Coach. Yep, thank you.